I'm the principal of Elite Prep Academy. Welcome to our beautiful dormitory at the Byron. Uh, as the principal of Elite Prep, we are so excited to have opportunity to come to Opeca. And a look back at the history when we were first looking for a new campus for Elite Prep, uh, we found this beautiful site uh, in the town of Hopeka, and we were so impressed with the lake and with the nice people, and we set our mind here. We wanted to be here. We want to make this beautiful town even more beautiful. So let me tell you a little bit about Ili Prep. We are uh, a school, a boarding school and a day school, offering programs for first grade through 12th grade. And we concentrate in music. Music is our heart and soul. So we have such unique curriculum, a combination of a general study and a music. Uh, we take the students very young, uh, as, as young as first grade, and based on their talent and the music pre preference, we assign them a, a major instrument to study. So I know uh, for all the neighbors we talk, talk to, I know a lot of kids in Hopi County, a lot of kids in this neighborhood, they all study music. Uh, we had, I met a, a number of uh, piano teachers, string teachers, they're all very excited. Oh, my kids study music. Now you have a home for that. And studying music is going to be part of what they do daily. So let me tell you about what they do actually every day. So in the morning, they have their regular study. They of course, science is important, English is important, they can study math, and we have a very small classroom. So our uh, teacher and the student ratio is 1 to 10. So we have a very small classroom, they're going to study with a wonderful teacher from Elite Prep. So that's the first thing in the morning. Now in the afternoon, that's where the music program kicks in. We have uh, music theory, we have ear training. Ear training is such important for young kids to, to have a music year. And uh, also, of course, have a music lessons. All these students study twice a week of the music lessons on the instruments. And uh, practice. Uh, we have uh, designated practice rooms for the students. So uh, during the day, some of them take uh, ear, ear training class, and some of them go into the practice room to practice. And uh, that, it's very, very welcome from my experience, uh, a very uh, welcome news for all the parents because now when the kids go home, the majority of the works are already done. Your kids already practice music. Now they go home to have fun with the parents, right? So because what do we do, we have a monitor practice. They have a weekly, uh, bio, uh, weekly lessons, uh, twice a week lesson actually. And they really make huge, huge progress. Now, besides the instruments they play, we really emphasize uh, ensemble. So from very young age, they start playing uh, music in terms of uh, classical music, like piano trio, string quartet, we're going to string orchestra. Uh, that's an, all the way to, let's say, rock bands, jazz bands. You name it, we're going to have that. So we want the kids to have fun. They learn music not only for the benefit of themselves, they wanted to learn how actually learn teamwork, how to work together, to listen to each other. This is going to really help them to build their future career, either in music, academically, I and mean, everything in general in life. So we are very, very excited to bring this program to the Town of Hope Camp. And, uh, we have a talk to uh, the residents of the Hopi Camp. Uh, this, uh, we have a great relationship already established with uh, the, the Hopi Camp schools. And uh, we donated uh, $30,000 of instruments, street instruments, uh, uh, back in March. And uh, we have about 40 students already sign up uh, the stream program with us. We supply a teacher there. So she, uh, her name is Miss Ma. She went to, uh, since March, she went to the school to coach these 40 students in cello, uh, in violin. These are kids very, very excited. And uh, starting this week, uh, the, the, the second week of May, 
the students will be able to take the instrument home to practice anymore. So that is just only the beginning of this, I call the beautiful relationship because we are looking for much, much more we can do with the school district. And uh, the school district has been so supportive and uh, we wanted to get this started and stay here and have a long lasting relationship. So we are going to move to the old Hassan Maxim building. And uh, actually we not only inherited the building, we named our music school the same name as well because we want to keep that tradition. So not only uh, we're going to make an inside, we're going to make a, a recital hall, we uh, also have uh, practice rooms, teaching studios, all soundproofed uh, inside of the building. But outside, we're going to make the landscape much, much better as well. We are going to make the column outside with, uh, with metal, glass, make a such much more modern look. Um, so you will all see the building going to be upgraded. Some of the old windows will be replaced, will be repaired. Uh, so very soon you will see the building will be modernized. You're going to see a, a, a new, brand new school going to be there. So we are very, very excited about that. And back to where we stay right now, uh, we are in Byron, our dormitory. This is called a Kobe Mansion. In the last week in the land use meeting uh, at Byron, and one of the members asked me why we picked this building uh, as a perfect location for our dormitory. And uh, I told them, because when we first saw this building, when we learned the history of the building was in the 1750s, we were so excited because in the 1750s, in music, that was a great time. Mozart was born there, Beethoven, Haydn, all these great masters. Uh, back in Europe, they are making tremendous music. And now we want our students to be here, not only study the history of music, they are going to live in history and make music. And I can't wait. Just like such a beautiful piano here and making modern music in such a historical building. And that's what is beauty supposed to be. And we are very, very excited. Hopefully we all get to stay here for a long, long, long time and uh, make music for the, for the, for the local uh, community and uh, come to see us. You, very soon you will see our students play beautiful music for you.